You just mentioned a member of a band, and I seem to recall that one of the people who uh, endorses your book has to do with a band. <laughs> yeah, you know, and that's, that's really um, something special, super special for me because uh, I laugh. Um, I, I'm also, I've been playing the drums since I was probably two years old. And I started on a little Muppets drum set, and I've always been inspired by music. And through some of my dark days, lyrical content and song has always really resonated with me. But one of my idols growing up was uh, the drummer for Kiss named Eric Carr. Mm. And I had always said, someday I want to meet him. And his reputation was... Uh, just a really genuinely nice guy, did a lot for fans, very approachable. Um, everything I had heard said this is just a really nice role model for kids. Mm. And unfortunately, I never had the chance to. He passed away uh, of cancer in the very early 90s. But I was able to meet his sister, who um, runs ericcar.com, mm. and she keeps his legacy alive. So she has since become a friend of mine. I meet with her typically once a month, and we share stories and share mm. tears, and she knows, um, knows my story about my son. We did a, uh, did a make-a-wish uh, make trip and took some pictures with one of her brother's shirts on with a Make-A-Wish logo in the background and kind of took his memory with us to Disney World. Wow, like you're really good friends with her. Yeah, it was, it was really special. So What's her name? Uh, her name is Loretta Caravello. Mm. And so she knows, she knows our story. And she was very gracious to endorse the book and write a really nice piece for the book. And she shared with me a, a picture that's included in the book of her brother behind a drum kit. So it's been really, really special and, and just super meaningful when you have an idol like that yeah. to be able to bring it full circle around in a book that is also talking about difficult stuff, yeah. but also it's rewarding as well because she's helping to keep her brother's memory alive and it's my very simple way of doing it as well, but tying it into our story because he was just that important to me. Mm.